Capcom. I wish. <laughs> Capcom. I wish it was like a bunch of children. Capcom. Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney, Justice for All. It's just like one fat kid. Justice <laughs> for All. Justice for All. Shut up, Craig. Oh, uh, but I wanted to take part. No. No. Now it's time to press buttons and talk with Maggie and Rosie D. Did we break our Cyclox yet? I don't know. It's new session. It's been, it's been a while for yeah, us. Yeah, we broke her. So okay. Okay. Uh, let's oh yeah, we gave her the thing, right? Let's check out what our evidence is. Um, got this article about. Oh yeah, yeah, because there is the the Rumors legend. Of a some alleged saucy stuff <laughs> going on between Juan and Miss AI Battery Girl. Okay. Uh, okay. What is this guitar uh, case next to the victim? There's some, some water. water. Okay. Only on the top. Uh, a wine glass. Juice. Oh yeah, because after the murder scene, there was a nice little wine glass just sitting there. Right. The heck's that mean? Okay. Crime photo. Oh! Rest in peace, nerd. I'm dead. That's what he said. I'm dead. That's what most dying people say. Oh. Hotel guide map. Okay. Cool. Yeah. And I think a lot of camera stolen the night of the murder. Okay. Uh, radio transceiver originally. F oh, so this is what we used to talk to, Mr. Our buddy. Creepy. Yeah. Uh, number 16. Okay. Nickel Samurai. Okay. That just represents the post-ceremony show. Okay. Nickel Samurai. Okay. He's beautiful. I love him. Alright. Uh, in the right. mind. Okay, yeah, okay, okay, let's okay, go, let's go, okay. let's go. Okay, let's go. Stop dicking around. We've Speed gotta run. hurry. Yeah, okay. Um... Do we... Have, are we ready for this? I guess Yeah, not. we're ready for this. Okay. It's doing. Alright. Get ready to do some funny voices. Oh, they're gonna be super funny. Detective Gumshoe said they had an investigation briefing. Oh. Yeah. Oh, he's back. Hey, so you came, pal. Why the blunt greeting? Uh, because there's nothing to be friendly or happy about. Well, that's pretty morbid, Gumshoe. We just started the session. What do you mean by that? Everything's depressing and terrible. Okay, what do you mean by that? Well, things look perfect this time around. The evidence and testimony are airtight. But, but, we can't just roll over and die. We have to stay positive and don't tell me yes we can. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Airtight hey, evidence. What's wrong, dummy? Literally. So, what do you mean the evidence is airtight? I can't give you all the details, pal, but there's two big pieces. Oh god, not the big ones. The two? And both of them are in this photo. Okay. Yeah, we have this photo. The first is the button that's missing from the victim's chest. Hmm. That's the button you found during your body search of Mr. Ungard. Yep, I found it in the folds of the Nickel Samurai special pants. Oh, not his special pants. Um, uh, and the second one is? The knife in his chest, pal. The fingerprints on the knife in his chest, to be exact. Fingerprints? Um, whose are they? You didn't even have to ask, little missy. It's obvious. They're mad on guards. Well, shit. Well, balls. Tomorrow's trial. Talk about being stuck between a rock and a hard place. Airtight testimony. So what about this airtight testimony? It's that old security lady, Ms. Oldbag. My favorite. I thought so. What do you mean, that you thought so? Did she tell you something, pal? Uh, well... And I even told her not to open that mouth of hers and blab to anyone. Her blab knob is stuck on tin, and there's no turning it down. Trust me. Yeah, well, Ms. Oldbag saw it all, pal. She saw Mr. On God come out of the victim's room around the estimated time of death. No way! Wow. Yeah, way. Wow. Okay, what do you want to look at, Pro uh, Gumshoe? <laughs> professor Gumshoe. Let me say professor. <laughs> I, was gonna hey, I like the professor. sound of that! Uh, I don't know if you'd care about that. Guitar case? It's gotta be something. Uh, Dark Hire the photo. Uh, oh. Because he was like, there's two- or no, he talked about him, I guess, but- Oh, that's true. Maybe he'll say something else? Some little bonus. You look at this photo and you can't help it. It makes you want to say, I can't believe this is the scene of a murder. Stabbed with a knife after a struggle. A clue is sleeping in this photo somewhere. I know it. Looking for that blue paw print. Uh, okay. Hotel guide map, camera. Does he know anything about this? Because uh, it was... I don't no, think so. no. No, 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 pal! 
I can't believe it's not butter. Right. <laughs> it's it's margarine actually. It's very low fat. All right. Um, well, recent studies show that this saturated fat is Try the article, I guess. Not, uh, there he is. We're pretty interested in this bit of gossip ourselves. The scandal with Mr. Karita. But why? Well, two years ago, a woman committed suicide. Damn. Suicide? Her name was Celeste Impacts. And she was Juan Carita's manager. The victim's manager? But that's not all, pal. Ms. Impacts was a Ms. Adrian Andrews' mentor. She taught Ms. Andrews everything she knew about the business from square one. Her mentor? A woman who was both Mr. Carita's manager and Ms. Andrews' mentor. Could her suicide have something to do with this case? Nah. Do you want to know more about her, pal? No, forget it. She's dead. Doesn't matter. Uh, Tell us about it. Tell us about Celeste. Tell us about it. She was the victim's manager and was also Ms. Adrian Andrews' mentor. It's been two years since her suicide, and now those two are linked again by another death. Or maybe it's just a coincidence. What the hell? Ow! Did I kill him? Finally. I'm getting sick of dealing with one foolish idiot after another. But it is Von Karma! You can't seem to stop allying yourself with the enemy, can you? But they're so nice! I don't need a traitor in my midst. Y y you don't... you don't mean... I do. Scruffy. You have 30 minutes to get out of here. You are no longer needed. Goodbye. But that's... W wait please wait, sir! If I don't get this month's pay, I'll stop. Quiet! If it weren't for traitors like you... Is this... I, I think I know, but I want to want. Is that what you want to say? Why do you sound like that? You sound silly. H who? That voice. <laughs> Edgeworth! <clears throat> Sorry, I had a frog in my throat. It's been a long time. Right. Th this person? This is Mr. Edgeworth? What am I going to do with you? Still blaming others when things go wrong? You haven't changed a bit, Francisco. <laughs> what? Shut up! <laughs> you, wh what do you mean? It's everyone else's fault. I don't do things wrong. How dare you show your face to me without a shred of shame upon it! You've soiled the Von Karma name and dragged it through the mud! Run away with- did I, how I just beat myself! <laughs> I dodged it. Run away with your tail between your legs like the ill-bred dogs that you are! Are you talking about the Von Karma family creed? To be perfect in every way? Then let's hear it, Francisco. How are things going? I'm perfect in every way. I hear you are having a rough time maintaining perfection in this country. No, nothing bad has happened. Shut I've won every bitch. case. <laughs> Why, you... You seem to be getting crushed under the weight of it all. No, I'm holding everything up. And that's why I came back. Because you're a basic bitch. Keep your assumptions to yourself. I... I haven't given in yet. I won't lose. This case is mine. I'll never hand it over to you. Never. Ow. <laughs> Again, I'm super good at dodging. You've, like, reflected it. How did you do that? Mirror move, bitch. I want to learn mirror move. <laughs> Mr. Phoenix Wright. I will see you tomorrow, and I will learn mirror move in court. You have a TM for that? No. No. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Where will I find it? It will be a clinical lesson on the meaning of total victory. Goodbye. Have a nice day. <laughs> Still the same wild mare she always was. She's a human being, Edgeworth. She's a... <laughs> no, she's not. She's... What are gallop you? a gallop. She's not a horse. I thought you, the prosecutor Miles Edgeworth, had gone and died. Mr. Nick, he's a ghost. Uh, I... I never wanted to see you again. You never called me. I think that's enough of a, of a warm welcome for someone you haven't seen in a year. Are you going to run tomorrow's trial? You heard her, right? That wild mare hasn't given in yet, it seems, galloping around going... <laughs> she has, <laughs> she's never done that. So, no, I don't think I'll be making an appearance. That's... Your hatred for me is quite unhealthy, not to mention one-sided. But I will say one thing. I won't. You can't win on your own at the trial tomorrow. Yes, I can. What is that supposed to mean? I have something definitive that you lack. And that's the definition of teamwork. 
It's the power to find the truth. The truth? In order to understand this case, you have to understand a certain truth. Well, if you ever feel the need for my assistance, it is available to you. I'm not in charge of this case, so I can be a bit more generous with information. Just what is going on inside his head? And inside his pants? Come over, find out. Ooh. A lot of things may have happened, however, Manfred von Karma was still my mentor. And a perfect win record is proof of a von Karma. One year ago, you could not establish guilt in a few cases. Are those losses the reason you suddenly disappear, dis disappear, disappeared from the prosecutor's office? Did you leave because you'd lost your perfect win record? To think your motivation for prosecuting trials was so selfish. It had been better for everyone if you never came back from the dead, Edgeworth. Dedgeworth. That's what I'm going to call you now. Not Dedgeworth. Even, not even Deadworth. Dedge, Dedgeworth. Dedgeworth. Okay. I see. Then let me ask you something. Why do you stand in the courtroom? What is your reason? Because they won't give me a chair. It would be nice if we had chairs. Right? I have been t Ugh. It'd be cozy AF. Well, if it was Francisca, she would almost definitely say, I will defeat you this time. My German accent is terrible. The instant she saw me. But the courtroom is not a personal battlefield for prosecutors and lawyers, though that would be so cool if it was. I stand in the courtroom to defend my client, to save their lives. To save your client, you say? Those who think only of their own ego-driven goals. Those kind of prosecutors are reprehensible to me. You know, not everyone is a good guy, right? That there are criminals that what? exist. What? No, everyone I defend is... Okay. Even if you're a prodigy, or someone like you, Edgeworth. Dots. It looks like there's still a lot you have that yet to learn. Where's everyone getting dots? A lot I have yet to learn. Me? There's a Dippin' Dots uh, <laughs> vendor uh, down the street. No. Oh, Dippin' Dots. Yeah, pretty good. Hmm. Well, that's enough for now. The time when you will see is coming soon enough. What the hell are you talking about? The fuck are you talking I about? I want some Dippin' Dots. I guess we're probably done with him. Uh, is there anything we can present to him? Um, well, that sounded conclusive. I guess, let's I see. guess so. Let's see. Anything relevant to Edgy? Not really. Okay, let's, let's look around then. Look around. Maybe we can ask him about Francisco? Oh, maybe. Oh yeah, we can present people. Yeah. Oh yeah, I <laughs> forgot about that. Let's see, what do you think of Franny? Uh, what do you think? She's a literal horse. We are looking into... No, no, okay. no, no. No, no, what, no. What, really? No, you don't? No. She's like your sister. Who is that? That's Francisca von Karma. She looks She's like so an pretty. anime character. I'm surprised she doesn't look like a horse. Mr. Francisca's a horse. I don't know when people are animals or hum... Uh... Okay. Did we finish him? No. Oh, there were more Psyche Locks. Oh, were there? I think. Did, right. did we break Adrian's? I don't know. Let's go check. Okay. Hello, pal. Oh, hello. Hello. Hey, kids. Hello, pal. Thank you, Mr. Nick. You're welcome, pal. Why are you talking to me? <laughs> <laughs> because I'm just like you. That's not how I sound like. He always looks mad. Yeah, he's like, ugh. 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 Uh, we broke her, right? <laughs> I think we're the her. first. Yeah, she's the first one I we broke. I will break you. All right. What? All right. <laughs> Don't break me. Oh, okay. Oh. Something's changed. Something going on with double A. Uh oh. Battery girl. Hmm. Looks like Miss Andrews isn't here. But the second lock. That's not good. I still have a few questions I want to ask her, and I don't want those locks unleashed on the real world. And she has that psyche lock on her heart, right? Well, we don't have much of a choice. I guess we'll have to come back later. <sighs> okay. I really wanted to break that psyche lock. You smashed the little bits. Um, um, let's just see if there's anything what's in, in the What's in room. Juan's room, yeah. Probably nothing. Bears. Yeah, it's, bears it hasn't changed. Bears. Too many bears. A dick load of bears. Dick load of bears, get out of here, la da 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 la. Just throw a bear at her. I would love to throw Ow! a bear at her. Uh, do we expend you? I think, I think Willie's pretty much done. People are filling up at three now, it's very weird. I'm sure there might be a little bit more stuff. Probably. I, feel, I don't know exactly how I feel like Edgeworth has another thing. Yeah, yeah, didn't, like, let's, it didn't let's, have let's us, talk like, more to Edgy. Else. Just, oh, yeah, just throw right all here. our stuff out of space. 
All right, Edgeworth, I'm gonna throw all my stuff at your face. It's gonna be weird. Don't literally throw it. Um, Just show it to me. Not that. Crime try the crime photo, photo yeah, I guess. Yeah, that's relevant to the crime. No, no, no. Okay, try something else. Just hitting him in the face with a photograph. No, 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 no. <laughs> Stop. Uh, hotel guide map, a lot of camera. Oh, the radio transceiver. Yeah, maybe he not. No, 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 no useless. No, no. Um, um, do you know about the- you're a big nerd. No, 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 no. Maybe profiles. Uh, well. Try old bag, because she's gonna testify tomorrow. Oh yeah, he loves her. No. No. Okay, uh, the Defendo. Oh okay. yeah. While I was abroad, these deplorable types of actors became popular, I take it. Well, refreshing like a spring breeze is his motto. Re refreshing And what is so refreshing about a spring breeze? Sounds like the pollen is not treating him well this year. Ooh. 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 Maybe on the next episode, the pollen will, uh... I don't want to think about pollen. Oh god, I hate pollen. Sucks. Oh! <gasps> 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 <gasps>